My name is Paige. Welcome back to another video. I am so glad you're here. by the title of this video you guys will know a little bit about what's going on super honored to be in florida this weekend with sports illustrated i got an offer to come out and work with them and do some content with them and just meet the team this was obviously a huge honor to be asked to work with them really sad to leave tommy in rome before his match but we both gotta work so today's gonna be more of like a prep day for my weekend. So the first thing I'm gonna do is probably just like quickly rough blow dry my hair. I'm gonna put on like a little bit of makeup but not anything crazy. Gonna go run some errands. I also have a tailor coming in too. I have a bunch of boxes to open up. My stylist sent me a bunch of looks. I need to get tailored and just like I think some PR. So yeah just having like a chill day. Oh also my mom is flying in for the weekend because I haven't seen her in a long time and I'm gonna be so busy these next few months. This spring and summer has just sort of become like crazy last month. So, so yeah, I'm gonna pick up my mom tonight from the airport after my fitting. I also do wanna give a shout out to Rogue Beauty. This is not an ad. I have no skin in the game on liking or disliking these products. They did send this to me. They sent me like the starter kit and guys, I am obsessed with it. I literally just bought three more of both of these and two more moisturizers just to like have. This. They're very affordable skincare and like I just really, really love them. Obviously, I'm very grateful to get gifted a lot of different skincare and makeup products, but I do actually like supporting brands. Obviously, Rode is a big brand. It's really not in comparison to like the Estee Lauders of the world. It's definitely still a woman-owned, smaller but successful brand, and I just love supporting brands and buying stuff for myself sometimes. I think I'm gonna do a little bit of foundation and no concealer just like a little bit of this i've recently gotten back into using the luminous silk by giorgio armani truly the lightest weight foundation it literally feels like you're wearing nothing on your skin and i also really really like the shade range that they offer i feel like if you apply it on the thinner side you can get like a tinted moisturizer effect and then you can obviously like build it up into like a full glam look okay so here are the boxes i have to unpack i have my rolling rack out here i'm gonna unbox everything get it hung up for the tailor to get here to fit the looks but i'm very excited i will show you guys i'm probably gonna do like a little bit of a time lapse
match the fitting. But there's some other really pretty stuff that Brand sent that I'm probably not going to wear. Like this Miu Miu little blue scuba thing is so cool. I might actually end up wearing this on Saturday. So I need to try that on, but we can't tailor it because it's knit. And then Hervé Leger sent this beautiful bandage dress that I don't think I'm gonna wear, but it's really pretty. I also got some other PR. Frankie's Bikinis sent their new sweet shop. I'm really, really excited about that. And Prada Beauty sent their new makeup line, which I'm very excited to try. Brilliant Earth sent some diamonds for the weekend, so pretty. Then YSL sent some bronzer. I'm filming a ad with them, so I have to film that this weekend. All right, have a quick interview that I'm very, very excited about. The interviews with Bustle Mag. I met this editor, Samantha, last year through doing an interview with her and we became friends and she's very sweet. It's always nice to do interviews with editors that it like really feels like catching up. So I'm gonna hop on this Zoom now. So guys, this is Serena Williams' new beauty brand, Win Beauty. I've been obsessed with this lip oil. I also think it's so cute that the packaging and the components are um, neon green like a tennis ball. I'm so happy we have all the girls. I know. Today. I was like just saying to my vlog that like you're one of the editors. It feels like we're just catching up when we, when I know, we meet. I love it. I'm so excited to chat. Guys. <laughs> That's all here. Still in Rome. Forza Lazio. How do you say it? Forza? Forza Lazio. Lazio. Forza Lazio. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, I'm gonna run to Starbucks. Thank you so much. Thank you. I got a strawberry lemonade refresher. It's the sweetest thing you'll ever drink. Ooh, a lizard. It's the sweetest thing you'll ever drink. Oh, uh, it is so good. Ow! <laughs> She's back. That's not a good angle for me. <laughs> You're so cute. I just shot an ad for YSL bronzer and I actually really, really Love it, but that's why I'm full glam right now. Wow, this car's so nice. All right. Um, you haven't been in my new car, have you? No, I haven't. It's very nice. Oh, Is it Mexican food your favorite food? You know what? I think it might be. But yeah, we're going to go to dinner now and then... I'm probably gonna be jet lagged and tired, but I'm gonna go to bed early. I have like a lot of organizing to do with like all the clothes kind of exploded today. So I'm gonna organize, chill. I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. So first it's like the welcome dinner for Sports Illustrated. Um, Friday night, not doing anything besides just like going to that event. And then Saturday, I'm doing a takeover on their Instagram and like a bunch of stuff at like the Saturday brunch. Tomorrow is just like a welcome red carpet thing. I'm very excited and I'm very excited to meet the girls and the team. Good morning guys. I'm gonna make myself an iced coffee. It's about 10.30 right now. I have a meeting and then I'm getting my nails done and then we're gonna watch Tommy's match, and then I'm getting hair and makeup done, I think around five. Yeah, I'm just gonna make myself an iced coffee. I'm very excited about the meeting that I'm about to take. Also, if you can't tell, I got a fake tan. Last night, or I fake tanned myself last night, and it came out really dark. I'm feeling very, very tan, but my dress is like fully cut out on the top and the back, so I guess it's a good thing. It's really just like my regular coffee, cold brew, whole milk, and then I do a little bit of like, a little bit of agave, 
vanilla bean paste and heavy whipping cream. I bake with vanilla bean paste and I don't use vanilla extract. I think I the vanilla flavor is so much stronger when you use vanilla bean in your baking or even when you're making a drink. I love like the little vanilla beans in it. Even vanilla ice cream, I prefer vanilla bean over regular vanilla. So yeah, a little trick. They sell vanilla bean paste now at most grocery stores. So that's my drink this morning. I'm about to hop on this call and then we're gonna watch Tommy's match. Hi. Okay, I'm about to run out. I'm wearing this dress tonight from Helsa Studios. It's their new collection. And then I'm wearing these sick St. Laurent chunky wedges. I got my makeup done by someone local in Boca tonight and she was amazing. I'm gonna leave her um, information in the bio because she was so, so good. Okay, I'm gonna bring a ring light tonight because finally charged my ring light. So I look very oily. <laughs> Um, wait, come show your outfit. Yeah. My mom looks really pretty. We're about to run out. You look so cute. Thank you. Okay, so we're gonna head out. I actually have like a lot of actual friends that are rookies this year, so really excited to see them. So cute, we just stopped by the hotel room that Sports Illustrated got for me this weekend. And just before the event, I'm gonna be getting ready here tomorrow. And so sweet, they left all these really cute goodies. A super cute note. It is 7.20. I probably wasn't smart. I really wanted to stay at our place this weekend. Like any chance that I get to stay in my own bed these days, I'll take it. Sports Illustrated got me a hotel room and that's where I'm gonna be getting ready today. My call time's at 10 a.m. But we had to leave the party last night at like midnight drive all the way back to Boca, it's like 45 minutes, and then now we're driving back to get ready. But we probably should have stayed at the hotel that they got me, but it's okay. Anyways, we're on the way there now. I have makeup starting at eight, working with this really amazing makeup artist today, so very excited about that. I'm on my own for hair today, which is a very scary thought because Hair is my weakest skill. So, probably just gonna do like an updo because it's so hot. But there's a red carpet tonight um, that I need to try to find someone to do my hair for. So, I'll keep you guys posted on that. Show you guys my full dress once I get downstairs. Hi guys, I have a fruit platter. I just ran up to the room. 
to rest for a second. It's very hot today. I can't even believe I still have makeup on my face. It's really hot. I'm just gonna eat something and chill, run back down to the pool. I have a few more things I need to do and then I have to shower. We're doing completely new glam hair makeup for the red carpet tonight. I have a really, really fun dress. Probably my favorite dress of the weekend that I'm gonna be wearing tonight. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hello vlog, I am all ready to go. I have to say this is probably the best hair and makeup that I've ever gotten done. I honestly feel like it's such a personal preference of like connecting with, oh you're so sweet, it's all good. Connecting with your hairstylist and makeup artist in a way that like what you both like like I actually let tonight Both of the artists kind of like decide based on this dress What the look should be and it ended up like perfect. I don't usually wear my hair down like this like I usually do a half up half down or a polished look and he really wanted something like undone and different and then my makeup is just like gray and simple. This is the dress. This dress was sent from Grace Ling. Such an honor to wear it. It is something that's definitely a little bit out of my comfort zone, but so we're about to head down to the carpet. I just have to wrap up some of my stories and stuff. And then I have to edit my reel. I'm doing a collab reel with them that's going live tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna head down there now, hopefully get some cute pictures and then we're gonna drive back to Boca tonight because I wanna sleep in my own bed. Um, but I'll keep you guys posted on the night. Okay, big fan of this YouTube channel. I watch it. Yeah, I think 